avocado was in desperate need but there's its top and see little root nodes forming all over it's really weird I don't think I'm changing the water out enough and I think there's too much light and heat on it so that's just something we know we did wrong kind of but we've just been overcrowded and the avocado is now in the little bathroom Stands up to about my chest. This is where it was taught. It's taught. It's grown that much more. But it was not really root bound. The roots actually, there was, they were plentiful, but not real bad. There's Angel. I think Kiddo's playing a video game. Anyhow, there is the avocado transplant. It should be good for about another year or at least. We could probably keep it in this pot pretty consecutively for a while, but eventually we'll probably want something a little bit taller. This one comes about to my shin. But there it is, you guys. We transplanted the avocado tree. We got one of these little stake things too to kind of help prop the top up because it starts to sag when it gets in the heat but it loves humidity so this little bathroom kind of traps a lot of heat and humidity in here and a tropical environment for it and it'll pick perk back up hopefully and transplanting it there you go over there's a good chance this whole bucket which I <laughs> I found out there in that field but <laughs> during, one of our wind storms. during a windstorm and I set it aside and nobody came back and claimed it so we put some holes in it and we put the winter over hot red cherry in it the hot red cherry is probably not one that we will uh, be wintering over or keeping we just wanted to see what it was like to winter a pepper through inside so we will be wintering at least one pepper plant every year but we're probably going to pick something really unique and something that all three of us can kind of enjoy and in are interested in as far as trying to get peppers when it's freezing cold outside. But we are gearing. We're expecting a climbing 70 to 80 degree weather for probably the next 8 to 10 days. So eight to ten days of warmth the nights shouldn't be dropping below 45 to 50 the days sitting around 70 
glass jam corn, orange tender sweet watermelon. None of the long handled or small bottle gourds have sprouted so I might have to try to paper towel germinate those or they might just be taking longer. Black diamond watermelon, one of those has grown real strong. And then the strawberry popcorn, there is one in there and a couple here and a couple here so strawberry popcorn, black diamond watermelon, glass gem corn and orange tender sweet watermelon are already going. There's kiddos tray. Yeah, that's not bad. I think it got compressed in there a little bit over the it year. Did. It was very. We could have done a lot differently with it, but oversaturate and learn from these mistakes and then take a refined uh, rhythm into next year, right? May 5th, 2018.